In this video, I'm going to show you how to find magazine or journal articles using a library database. So I'm starting on the library's homepage, and then I'll click our Research Databases link. Databases are just collections of information, and the first thing we have to do is decide which database is most likely to have journal or magazine articles related to art history. So the easiest way to narrow down this list of databases is to click on the Databases by Subject tab. When we scroll down, we see a list of different subjects that you might want to conduct research on. Our subject falls in this category, Arts, Music, and Performing Arts, and it brings us to this list of databases. Every database specializes in a different collection of information. This one here, Oxford Art Online, is a reference source, so it's like a background source. Some of the other ones, like Art Full Text, Project Muse, JSTOR, these specialize in journal or magazine articles. For most topics, Art Full Text is going to have the majority of information that we own in the library, so I'll start my search here. Today, I'm trying to research the making of Celadon ceramics in China and or Korea. And so the first thing I have to do is figure out how do I tell the search engine in this database how to find an article that I want. What I don't want to do is ask it a question. What, how are ceramics made in China, right? Because the search engine will look for that exact phrase in the article and the odds are it won't find it. So I have to pull out the keywords. And for my search, I think the keywords are Celadon and then China or Korea. I'm going to search for the two topics separately because the odds are there will be more articles that research ceramics in one country at a time than an article that's going to talk about both together. So I'll start looking for Celadon and Korea. Now when I search, click the search button, I get back 34 results. This database um, tells me about articles that we own, but also articles that we don't own. So in order to make your life easier, please limit to what we have in full text, which are those articles we own. So the first article I see is called Enduring Elegance, Goryeo Celadon, right? That's the title of the article. It's in a journal called Coriana. I can click here to see the PDF. And before I do that, I might want to read the abstract to see if it's going to help me understand my topic. Once I click the PDF, I see the PDF, the full text of the article here. And at this point, I can email it to myself. Um, I can export it. I can print it. And I can even look at um, the citation for the article if I want. This article here in Ceramics Monthly shows up as HTML full text, and you can see it here. You could even listen to it if you want. And when you click this link, it'll show you how to cite it, right, in a variety of citation formats, including Chicago. And as I go through the results, if I scroll down here, there's one article called The Eternal Link in Ars Orientalis, and it's talking about grave goods of the Koryo Kingdom. That looks good to me. In this case, the full text isn't inside this database, but we own the full text somewhere else. So all I do is click this link to Full Text Finder. And it will take me to the text of the article here in a different database. And on, in this database, to download the PDF, I click this link. Let's try out looking for Celadon in China and see what we get. <clears throat> so I'm still limited to full text, so I have 27 articles to choose from. It's the same exact um, process. Now, if you got back very few search results, there's a way that you can do a meta search inside this database. And to do that, you would click the Choose Databases link. And I'm going to recommend to you two other databases you might want to add to your search if you're not getting enough results on your topic. One is Academic Search Complete, which is kind of like the Nordstrom of databases or the Macy's. It has a little bit of everything in it. Um, and the other one that you might want to consider is Soch Index with full text, because oftentimes um, these art pieces or artifacts perform a specific function 
in the life of the culture, and they might discuss it here. But you'll need to consult with your teacher to see if articles coming from outside the art history field are okay for her for this assignment. So I'll conduct my search again. Having selected those additional databases, you can see I get 151 results. I'll limit to full text again. And you'll see now I have 50 results instead of what I had before. So I hope this is helpful. Good luck on your project.